safety bill that could give doctors protections when it comes to performing legal abortions to save a woman's life. Our John Piersos tells us how the bill could let doctors do their jobs without fear. Tennessee law allows doctors to perform abortions to save a woman's life or prevent serious injuries, but doctors must be prepared to defend themselves in court to prove the abortion was a last resort. So that's why it's so dangerous to women and, and to physicians is that there's you have to balance between malpractice or a felony. The bill would still allow doctors to perform abortions in extreme cases using reasonable medical judgment, proving the necessity of the abortion would no longer be required. Dr. Laura Andreessen, an OBGYN from Franklin, says the bill that passed the House Monday is a step in the right direction, but she says it doesn't go far enough. But it leaves us a lot of vulnerability in the area of other complications of pregnancy, such as cancer, or such as cardiac or diabetes cardiac issues, diabetes. Dr. Andreessen says women in Tennessee are being forced to travel out of state for those procedures and would like exceptions to be made in those cases too. The House bill was sponsored by Republican Esther Helton Haynes. In a statement, she said, in addition to providing better clarity to existing state law, House Bill 883 decriminalizes doctors in emergencies when they have determined a medically futile pregnancy has endangered a mother's life. In Knoxville, John Piersos, WVLT News. The bill did pass the House overwhelmingly yesterday. 83 to 11 was the vote. A similar bill has to go through the Senate next before it can be voted on there.